my That's life. That's what this is? Who says I'm not dreaming about you as well? You're acting like those dreams of yours are nightmares. They're not. They're sweet dreams. And who said that mine are only nightmares? Mine are sweet dreams as well. I dream that we're happy together forever. Listen, Olga, in my dreams, we're already happily married and have children. Three. Three girls, and they're all as beautiful as you. Wrong. Three boys. All three of them have glasses, but they're all in different shapes and colors. They run all over the house saying, personal space, personal That's space. That's exactly right, and we're the happiest couple in the world, too. The happiest. We live our lives like it was a Precisely. fairy tale. Stop arguing. Are you listening to what you're saying to each other? Uh, I don't believe this. Uh, when someone has the love of their life in front of them, they can't ignore that. It doesn't make sense. They have to act on it and give it a chance. They should know that they have to accept one another, all of their good traits, all of it, as well as the bad. It's difficult, but they shouldn't waste any time. They have well, to act before it's too late. Well, then. Yes, you're right. Perfect. Sure. I should start serving the food to the girls. Yes, I'm most happy to help you. Will Let me you? take this oh, tray. That's great. Thank yes, you. here we are. <laughs> Excuse me. I was listening and I totally agree. I think you're right. And I love that you're so, so passionate, so motivated with your honesty and energy. Because Olga and Romalo deserve to be happy. They sure. deserve to act on their feelings. They deserve a bright future and a happy life together as a couple. And I think it's a matter of being brave enough. It's that simple. You're exactly <sighs> right. Seriously? Brave enough? I can't believe this. Really? I can't listen to this so early in the day. It's ridiculous. Excuse me? Don't you get it? You're clueless, Herman. I can't believe and that you're... Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh, look what you did. What I did? You did it? I can't believe this. Oh. Oh. I can't even talk to your dad. Look what he did. My fault? Oh, how could it be my fault? It was him who did it. Clearly things aren't going as well as I thought they were around the house. Um, Ludmilla, I think I'm worried about Angie, for all of us actually. But you're the only one who could talk to your mother, I guess. Yes, you have to believe me though. I know nothing more than I've told you. Every time I see her, I try to...